What's up, Trinology family? Welcome back to another episode of the Trinology News Talk. And today, we're going to be discussing the uh, the updates on Universal and Disney World for parts in um, a Universal. So, there's been a lot of um, uh, delays, closure uh, due to the uh, coronavirus uh, pandemic that's going on. But I'm here to give you a, a further updates as, as it's going on as far as the, the closure of the parts. And also the construction uh, project that's going on between your, your Universal and, and Disney World. Without further than that, let's get straight into it. So, Universal uh, Parks and, and Parks and Resorts Chairman and CEO Tom Woods put out the following statement: All construction projects around the globe, Super Nintendo World in Oscar, Hollywood, Universal's Epic Uni Universe in Orlando, and Universal's Virgin all remain active. On track with under protocols and establishments and government officials with all their support. So even though that their parts is closed, but they are uh, they still are content on uh, finish up the the construction process so that all the upcoming attractions and lands that they got out of Universal. But for Disney World, at the other hand, their parts is closed, but they put their construction projects on hold. And now I'm gonna give you the um. All the projects and uh, uh, attractions and lands that, that's going on. So we have the Space 22, 2200 restaurant that's going to be near the um, the Mission Space uh, uh, ride attraction in Epcot. We have Remy's uh, Ready to Your Adventure. It's going to be similar to the ride to the uh, at Disneyland Paris, and of course it's going to be at the France Pavilion, which is going to be updated as well. Then we have the Harmonious, which is the new Epcot nighttime uh, spectacular um, uh, fireworks show. And then we have the Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rewind, which has to taken over the, um, I forgot the, what was the name? Oh, shit. But, but yeah, um, the, the, uh, the, yeah, that construction, put a, it's a new um, roller coaster ride that, that's going to be coming to, uh, to Epcot. And uh, that's going to be hard. What else? Um, the Tron Life, Life Cycle Run, that uh, that's going to be near um, Space Mountain in Tomorrowland and at, at Magic Kingdom. Uh, the new Play Pavilion, um, the Epcot Multimedia Trans Transformation, which means Epcot going to get full uh, uh, new new lands, uh, uh, updates, and everything. Um, the Star Wars Galactic uh, Star Cruiser. Which is the new hotel is going to be right next to um the, the Disney Hollywood Studios, um, Ryan Up uh, Rodeo Barbecue, which is going to be a new, new the quick service restaurant that's going to be right inside of of Toy Story Land and Hollywood Studios, um, Mary Poppins Attraction, which is going to be in the uh, UK Pavilion in Epcot, and the Reflections uh, Late Side Log, which is also going to be another hotel. And then now we listed all the projects. Let's go through the timelines of what's going on. So this is the uh, the, the construction uh, pro project that's going on. So like I mentioned, um, Mary Poppins, the cherry tree that's supposed to be um, a, in the UK video at Epcot, that's in the early development, which was announced uh, last year at the D20 at the D23 Expo. So that kind of puts that in the walls of when that project is going to be starting. So. The site preparation, the reflections, the uh, late law, law, which is the uh, the hotel, the one of the new hotels is going to be coming. So now we have the the bigger part, the significant ones that are in process already. So we have the Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rhyme, Cosmic Rewind, the Tron Lego Cycle Run, the Epcot Transformation, the Star Wars Galactic Star Cruiser, uh, Roundup Rodeo Barbecue, and the Play Pavilion. So that could quite uh, just Based the question, so most of these uh, attractions they're they're, um, they're they're trying to get ready for the um, uh, for the 50th anniversary of Walt Disney World uh, coming next year October. So it really depends on like uh, when the when the parts reopen and the construction uh, go uh, go back at, at its normal process. It really depends on like how the this, the, the construction get finished before that time and how they uh, could it affect the um. Their projected uh, uh, opening day, it could be. So we we just had to know when the um, when the pandemic uh, 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 crisis is over 
and uh, and the parts back to the open, and then back to the um the regular co construction process, and we'll see how that goes. And for those who, that are, uh, and those are projects that are nearly like a completion, so that those are Remy's uh, Ready to Adventure, Space 2022, and Dizzy Harmonicas. Those are the, um the three that's going to be all going to be in um, in Epcot. So I had to think um on that. So there are two months remaining in construction before the closure. And the two and the three months, uh, the Canada eight week social distance in April and May, the booking will be unavailable. So, Rem Remy's Rabbit Two Adventure was scheduled to open and up in the summer. So, that makes the difference. So, I have to expect, like, um, when the parks reopen, uh, uh, I think they're probably going to open sometime in, uh, in the fall. That's the estimated opening period based on the current uh, the information. So we'll just have to wait and see um, uh, what they're gonna what they're gonna do for that. And uh, and uh, also I think the Space Twenty Two and the Harding Mart is gonna open around the same time in the fall. Even though those three um, attractions may have their own separate uh, opening date, but we'll just have to see um, what's uh, what's gonna go from there. And lastly for for today. Um, there, there, there was one movie that got pushed, uh, and that was um, George, uh, Jordan Peele's Candyman, uh, and um, it was supposed to come out in um, in June, but it got uh, moved to uh, moved to to September, and then well, it was September. Let me go back to my list and see uh, when it got moved to. Do, do, do. Hold up, y'all. Trying to get the um, find where's my release date is at. Yeah, here we go. So it's supposed to come out in June 12th. But now I got moved to September uh, to twenty fifth, well, which is not bad. So we still got a lot of uh, uh, other a couple movies that's still in play, but it hasn't not been changed yet. But we'll just have to see um, now what they're gonna do uh, by the time that uh, that, that much uh, that month uh, uh, get closer. So other than that. Um, that's uh, that's my uh, news for today. So I want to know what's your opinions uh, for all the theme park fans out there. What are your predictions on these uh, upcoming uh, projects from Universal, from Universal and, um, and and Disney World? So let me know in the comments below. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more uploads. And other than that, this is Trico, and I'm signing off. Peace.